Okay, welcome to more Legend of Heroes Trails from Zero. I do not really remember what we were doing when I left off. So let's find that out, I guess. Okay, I am here for some reason. Have I spoken to Wazy today? I do not see Wazy. You look like a fisher. You're just a tourist. I don't care about you people. This is your family? So, Wazy isn't here today? Yeah, sorry about that. Wazy's not here right now, but, uh... I'd appreciate if you stopped asking me that over and over again. But I also want to know where Wazy is. Random guy. So... Um, I want to go to the Bracer Guild really quickly. I want to check the board and see where everyone is today. And then track them down. I think that'll be a good thing to get out of the way early. Hi, what's up? It's about time. It's about that time when all those tourists start checking out the sites outside the city. I sent Estelle and Joshua off to St. Ursula today. Okay, so Estelle and Joshua are at St. Ursula. Uh, anyway, you better take care of yourselves out there. Honeys? Is that what he said to me? Okay. Well, at least he's being nice now. Okay, no one is up here. Let's look at the board. Hi. Okay. Arios is just outside. Scott is just outside. Wenzel is at the armory, whatever that is. Uh, Lynn and Aeolia are in the administrative district and Estelle and Joshua are at the medical college. Arios and Scott are just outside the city. What does that mean though? Like where? <laughs> where outside the city? What is my main task so that I don't accidentally do it? Ash Tree Inn. Okay, so don't go in an inn. I understand. Um, if you go to the Business Owners Association, that was in the Harbor District, and this is a monster extermination. The East Highway. Bubbly Scissors G. Such a fun name. Blind and hypnotize. I hate both of those things. Blind is a little less annoying than hypnotize, though. Because you at least still have a chance of your attack actually hitting. Okay. So I guess let's go to St. Ursula's. Talk to Estelle and Joshua. I am here now. They are not outside. Or at least not outside there. Um, they could be anywhere. Let's just make the rounds, I suppose. None of you people. Do you have anything for me? Ingredients from Mr. Hayworth. Mm. But you won't give me a recipe. A wall clock for Ellie. That's 10 grand though. I am perpetually broke in this game. I highly doubt they're in this area. But we might as well check. Who the heck are you? Oh, you're Linton. Finally, a break. It's not like I have any plans though. Maybe I should pick up fishing like Dr. Gwenter. You know what? Picking up fishing might actually be a good thing for Lytton to do. Because then he could go off 
with Gwenter instead of being left behind with all of Gwenter's work might be ideal for him. And I mean, fishing is just really fun in video games, so he should just do it. Eventually, I will find something I care about. It's bound to happen. Okay, I didn't think there would be anyone in this area, but, you know, might as well check. Okay. Now that I think about it, Isil and Joshua, they're probably at the uh, bottom floor. Wait, isn't this, um, Arios's child's? Where? Oh, they're in here. Never mind. Oh, wow. I knew they made braille books, but braille picture books? They're pretty impressive, aren't they? These three-dimensional pictures literally leap off the page. They really do, though it doesn't seem there are very many of them. When I'm older, I'd like to create braille picture books myself. But I can't help but wonder if someone like me could even manage that in the first place. Oh, Shizuku. I am sure your father will help you with anything you decide to do. Isn't there still a possibility that you'll be able to regain your eyesight, though? That's what the doctors say, but I think it's important to consider what I'll do if that doesn't happen, too. Sorry, I must sound annoying talking about silly things like that. Hey now, no being shy around us. Estelle grabbed Shizuku's hands and held them close. Estelle? I've got a great idea. Let's make picture books that every kid can enjoy, together. Don't you worry about a thing, Shizuku. We're here for you. You can tell just how much time and heart the author put into making this book. If this is really something you're passionate about, then as long as you hold on tight to that feeling, I'm sure you'll succeed. Estelle, Joshua, thank you so much. Oh, Shizuku, please don't cry. It's okay. Sorry, maybe I got a bit too cheesy there, didn't I? Precious. They probably wouldn't mind if we stepped in, but I think we ought to leave them be. I agree. It sounds like they're having a moment. Hey, there's always next time. Indeed, there is. I'm sorry, I don't know why I suddenly started crying. Aw, oh, don't worry about that at all. Now, Shizuku, prepare to get spoiled rotten by your big sister today. No ifs, ands, or buts. We shouldn't interrupt those three. Let's go, everyone. Okay. Oh, hey, that weird child is still staring at the laundry. Why are you like this? Same voice, uh, not voice line, same line. Not voice. I don't care about that guy. He might have something fun to say, but I, I don't care about that guy. Who are you? A random tourist. Okay. Hi. I'm starving. Since the nurse's breaks are divided up through a shift system, I often end up having to eat later than I'd like. Trust me, it's always embarrassing when you're taking temperatures and your stomach growls. <laughs> Lunch break can't come soon enough. Do you have anything else? No. Okay. Philia still has a lot to learn. Everyone gets hungry, even nurses. You don't have to starve yourself until your lunch break if you're really in that dire need to eat. Take me for example. When I'm on the move or have a moment's rest, I'm scarfing down a sandwich. Grit. That's what she needs. Hey, Mayfa. So, what kind of disease does Michael actually have? Oh. Well, it's a rather complicated one, from what I know. He'll need an operation to make a full recovery. But even if that's the case, he's just as scared to go through surgery as almost everyone. So we've reached an impasse until he agrees to it. Is that right? If he could just muster up the courage to get that operation done, he'd get better in no time. There has to be something that could give him that little push he needs. You know, you say some pretty wise stuff once in a blue moon. Even though they're only children, Shizuku and Michael are doing their best with the hand they were dealt. 
Okay, I guess the game wants me to go find Michael. I do not remember where Michael is. Okay, what's up? Surely a man that's as perfect a package as you must have a wife, Dr. Gwenter, or at least a girlfriend. I'm afraid I'm living the single life, but I actually quite enjoy it that way. You won't really find me mingling with the ladies at all. Now, putting my love life aside, this particular medical exam... Oh, there's no one special, thank Ideos. I, I mean, what a shame. Well, if that's the case, I think I'll volunteer tonight, you and me. Uh... Oh dear, not again. <laughs> I would feel bad for him, but you know what? Deserved. Is Michael in this room? No Michael. Well, here's Cecile. This is the clinical record Dr. Beldine asked for. Would you mind giving it to him later for me? Oh, sure thing. Thank you, Lan. Oh, hi, Lloyd. I'd love to sit down and chat, but I'm kind of pressed for time today. Next time, I promise. She must be swamped with work. Okay, who is Lan, though? Cecile is probably the most hardworking person I've ever met. She has so much on her plate, but she still makes time to help everyone else. I would love it if she rubbed off on Dr. Gwenter, that slacker. Good luck with that. Okay. Oh, you're the one who um, lied to me about the church and the drugs. Well, would you look who it is, Dr. Gailey. Pray tell, when are you planning to shave that scraggling mustache of yours? It's hardly befitting of a respectable doctor. Oh, Dr. Lago. It simply hasn't been long enough. It's a wonder that you haven't fixed that bald head of yours. It looks like someone took a torch to an Armorican pasture. How about you remove that terrible mustache with those surgeries you love so much? Oh yeah? Well, can your precious internal medicine fix that bald spot of yours? What? Say that again? I dare you. Looking for a fight, Lago? Fight. Grr. Gah. Looks like business marches on as usual at St. Ursula, even with the anniversary festival in full swing. Well, no complaints out of me can really change that, so I guess I'll just read a book or something. No one in here. Okay. I need to find, um... Michael. But I can't remember where Michael is, per se. Let's go to the second floor. Okay, we looked in here, yeah. That was where Gwenter was. Nurse's station. This was another group room, yeah. Okay, we need to go up again. Is this not the room Michael was usually in? Cause this is the, the guy that the girl spilled stuff on his sheets. Michelin is going to be the premier spot tomorrow. Thanks to that event, I'll be forced to miss. Given my circumstances here at the hospital, I didn't receive an invitation this year, but next year I'm sure... Michelin? Isn't that the wellness resort you can ferry over to from the harbor? So this is the kind of person you'd find cruising over to Michelin, is it? The place does have a ton of five-star restaurants and a high-class boutique, so I'm sure that'd be right up his alley. Well, Michelin will be having quite the event. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. So where is Michael if he's not in his room? What the heck? That's just a random child. That's really odd. Because they said he needed surgery or whatever. Maybe you can't find him. 
But I'm pretty sure that room over here, I'm pretty sure this was his room. For some reason, Dr. Gailey and Dr. Lago aren't exactly on the best of terms. Maybe it's because they are too much alike. Similar things repel, after all. Well, at least our hospital doesn't have to worry about the entire internal medicine and surgical departments being at each other's throats. Is this the surgery room? Okay, this is the ICU. Okay. Are you here to take your physical? If so, please fill out this paperwork. Since this is your first medical examination with us, it might take some time to prepare. Are you alright with waiting? I don't mind. Should I just sit over there? So odd. Wait. Wait, one more. That's just stairs. Okay. Okay. I guess we cannot find Michael. That's so weird, because they were really making it sound like they wanted us to encourage Michael to get his surgery or whatever. Uh, go back to Crossbell. Let's do the... I believe it was the East Crossbell Highway. That the extermination was on, yes? East Crossbell Highway. Yeah. Bubbly scissors. Sure. Take me to the East Crossbell Highway then. And then I guess we might as well just walk the whole way. Because I don't really know where on this highway it would be. And we might take a moment to stop at some some fishing spots because I have not I don't think fished in some of these early locations in my oh well here's here's the boss I want to fish first though hi okay fishing Okay, I definitely don't think I have fished here with the bamboo rod, so let's try that. Uh, and I guess they want me to try dumplings. I don't know how many more fish I need, but I think I'm pretty close to... The next rank. Let's try red flies. Okay, nothing. Novice rod. Only dumplings and earthworm. I've definitely tried earthworm here before. Got my way. Okay, then let's go ahead and fight this thing. What on earth is that? What is that? It's like a crab playing on a bubble and it also has bubble arm like shoulder pads. Okay, that's not the button I wanted. Save me, even though it's only been 20 minutes so it's not like we really lost anything. Okay, I'd, sure, let's, let's no time like the present. I probably should have healed Tio. Uh, her like EP, but here we are. Um, you have 200. Go ahead and cross Mirage. Okay, you analyze okay bubbly scissors g 
a huge crustacean that fights by spewing bubbles, causing various status anomalies. Okay, it resists poison, petrify, sleep, mute, paralyze, uh, hypnotize, I don't know what that is, and death blow. So we can, in fact, freeze it. It looks like. And you want to use wind. Okay, well, both of my magic -y people have, have all the wind options, so. Oh, it only has um 4k HP. That's that's not terrible. Okay. Let's get to work then. <laughs> That did a decent amount. Blinding bubbles. Oh, and it wasn't immune to blind. Okay, I want you to just attack and then we're gonna do this. Oh, okay. He put me to sleep, but I woke up. So, that's fine. Okay, you. Wind. Area medium. This will hit both, but it requires you both to stay in the circle. I think we, we chance this. Oh yeah, they, they don't get a turn before I get to do my art, so it's, they're definitely not moving. Um, you also... I highly doubt they're gonna move from this circle. That was nice. It does so much. Yes. Okay. Um, you just attack. Delaying bubbles. Okay. I want you to. This gives you the critical. Which sounds fantastic. So go ahead and do that and get the critical. Uh, you can... Attack this one to make sure it dies. Okay, good. One down. Um, you... I would like to heal us. Dang, okay. I guess heal those two and then Tio is on her own. Okay, you. That's excessive. Just do sparkle. Get countered, I guess? Okay. That was not that bad. Bewitch times two. 